Assalamu alaikum. So today what we will do is we will continue our Flutter tutorial from Figma design to Flutter tutorial demonstration. So many of you requested me to do in English. So this tutorial I will be doing in English in future videos if your support is continuous. So what was I? I have done last tutorial. I was like in this section. So what I have to do now is to make i will try to make these five elements so these five elements for each of them has a different uh, a different a button a text and there is an ending tag so this tag will match them so now, for now i will now use no logic and now i will just simply make one of this element so first of all i have to change this i have changed this and uh, just return some container there and uh, length will be like one and i will make a flag while why will i do require flag i will tell in some moments but before no oh, sorry good flag also before doing this as there is a state i will be managing so if i click on this there will be this button and if i or again click this there will be unchecked so marked and unmarked i have already exported these two images in this my assets slash icons folder and added them to my pubspec.yml file so let's continue so what I will have to do now, I have as I am managing a stateless widget, I have to convert it to a stateful widget. So I will write extends stateful widget. And if I do this, I will have a red error. So I will overwrite it and I will rename this my home state. And I have to change this to state my home. And I will return my home state and if I have to hot reload then you will notice no certain change in this as I have removed the list and I have something like that so I have to now make something here so what I will do is I will as I have taken a container I have to eat I will think is it as a container at of a height of full width and 60 so make like this so i will take height of 60 and width of media query dot of context dot size dot width so after this i will take a child and my child uh, would be a stack why would be a stack so i as if I use tag I will I can use positioned widgets so I can position exactly where my things were so I will have to use tag so stack will have children and in children I will use position tag and positioned and I have to now select from where I have to some constraints here so left right now things will get some complicated the first child is here is a button but there is not ordinary button so i will use a gesture detector on tab it will change to marked from unmarked and the child would be a image dot asset where assets the file names be asset slash icons slash marked for now i will say this and i will make them 15 50. i will have not made so what is my problem my problem is that i have not given a correct so i will just copy the names from here and provide them here return a container with height yes everything looks fine to me then what is the problem here
No, sorry, double T. So if I now see presently this, you can see there is a marked oh, kind of similar. So that works for me. So again, now we'll change it. So we have to now calibrate it as it were in our last video because I will be using it in variable screen sizes. So we have to make them. consistent within screen so these are width and width would be like 345 and width from 16 so from top it is 16 let me show you so top from top it is 16 from left it is 16 so I have add these two parameters and I will just now build it and if as you can see there is it now I will add the functionality of when I will click this it will set and unset so for this I need a flag so I have added the flag here and uh, the flag will continue I will use on tap and I will use set state and state will be flag equals to inverse of flag so if flag if flag then show unmarked if flag then show unmarked and if not flag if it is false then show marked no sorry so something like this so so this now works so using set state i have successfully done this so now come to the next part so i have to add the text so start making presentation so I have to add another position item and now then I have to add another position item so three position so the second would be I have to calculate the from top it is 6 from top it is 19 from left it is 60 so 9 from top it is 19 from left it is 60 and the child is here is a text field so I will add text and what is the data inside it start making presentation so I will write start making a presentation I will make it exactly replica of this like so I will using I am using exactly like this so now how can we make this tag so we can use this by two things we can export this thing there's a button called export and we will just export this export list and uh, we will export it to exactly where we would have saved the other two so into the studio asset icons and i will name this it will be automatically named so what is the name it has been named list so i will delete the folder and move it to and i will rename it i will rename it to what was the tag for this work so i will use work work tag so i have used work tag and uh, i have to add it to pubspec.yml so just copy it and paste it below and name unknowns work.png if you save it the visual studio code will automatically make all the necessary things and uh, i have to now add this where i have to see its position where it is so i press option in 437 and 24 from top so I will copy these two and child would be a image button not a flagged one so there is a no flag in this just a simple image Let me, uh, so just a simple image no flags 
nothing just a simple image with the name of work.png and it will be like from left how many from left it is 300 and what is it 300 oh sorry it is 375 so i have to change this 375 so 375 so from left it will be 347 if i reload this it's a kind of like similar so thus we have converted so there is a problem now that the text the size of text doesn't match so we can edit this by uh, making it like bigger so what we can do is like text style uh, text default is like 80 so text style font size and font change the font size to 20 and if I reload it kind of similar uh, I have to make it 18 to perfect so make it like 18 and it's perfect is it some kind of bold or something so if it is bold or there's a weight so i will add font weight to font weight dot weight 200 or 300 so this too much weight 600 hmm 600 is very fine 500 would be like exactly so exactly like this so this works everything now kind of works except this is kind of like off balance so i have to lower it down so where it was from is it from oh, 19 no, it was 24 that is why it is off axis so if i use 24 now it is exactly like this so thus we can make a so make a list of them mark and mark and make it switch it to a model or something and uh, make the and it is also a scrollable thing and whole screen is scrollable that is a good thing the whole screen is scrollable it is also scrollable and the whole thing is scrollable so that would be all for today thank you and the next i will be working on working on these remaining times and the later will be i will providing the list how to implement this exactly like this list so thank you